Hello friends, how is everybody? In uh, friends, in today's video, we are going to learn some very useful and cool tricks of Microsoft Office, Microsoft Office through which we can save our time in Office world. So uh, let's start now. Uh, first of all, uh, if we want to draw a, if we want to draw a border, what we will do? We will insert three or four times minus sign. Then we will press enter. See, this border has been drawn. Mostly uh, where this border is used, this border is used mostly in res, uh, resumes or CVs. Uh, for example, if we uh, right here, uh, sorry, if we buy right right here qualifications, and we want to draw border below this uh, word, what we will do? Same, uh, three or four times we will press minus sign, then we will press enter. See, this border has been drawn below this word. So next thing, uh, if we want to draw a border, same same like this border, but uh, a bold border than this. What we will do? We will uh, right here three or four times uh, underscore. Then we will press enter. See, this border is drawn, but this is bold than previous border, first border. So next, if we want to draw a dotted border, what we will do? We will write here three or four times this star sign. Then we will press enter. This dotted border has been drawn. So uh, next, if we want to draw a double border, what we will do? We will uh, write here three or four times equal sign. Then we will press enter. This uh, double border has been drawn. So now, if if we want to draw a bold border. Double border, bold double border. What we will, we will do? We will write hash key three, four, five times, and we will press enter. See, this is bold double border. So uh, next trick, if we want to, uh, you have been seen um, most of people, professional people, professionally in professional emails, mostly arrows are used. Uh, so now we will see how to draw arrows in uh, Microsoft Outlook or Microsoft Word. Uh, to draw arrow, what we will do? We will uh, press two times. Minus sign, then we will press a sign greater than. See, this arrow has been drawn. If we want to draw same uh, arrow, but in opposite direction, what we will do? We will write here a smaller than key, and two times minus sign. See, this has been drawn. But now, if we want to draw a bold arrow, same arrow but in bold, what we will do? We will write uh, two times equal sign, then greater than sign. See, this arrow is bold. So, sorry. So what we will do next? If we want to uh, draw same arrow in opposite direction, direction, this is same procedure. Smaller than sign, then two times equal sign. Okay. Next, if you want to draw arrow in, uh, see these all arrows have one head. In uh, these are going in one direction, maybe in right or left. If we want to draw a, an arrow with uh, direction in both sides, double head arrow. What we will do? We will write smaller than sign. Then equal sign, then greater than sign. See, this is arrow has been drawn that has direction in uh, that that has head in both directions. Next, if we want to uh, draw smileys, some people also draw smileys in Microsoft Word. So, uh, how we will draw smileys? What we will do? Uh, we will write column key. We will write column key. Then we will write this close bracket key. To uh, make smiley, we will draw here three types of smileys. But I have uh, I have not drawn these two signs together. But because I if I draw these signs together, this smiley will be drawn. So you cannot see uh, how uh, I draw this smiley. So now I'm uh, drawing this smiley. What I will do? Colon sign. Then I'm going to draw a bracket closing bracket sign. See, this smiley has been drawn. We want to uh, this smiley. Uh, this is smiling. If we want to draw smiley of sad, sad smiley. What we will do? We will write colon key. Then we will uh, write. We will insert here a bracket opening bracket. See, this is smiley with sad face. Uh, if we want to, uh, if we want to draw an another smiley with straight. This is a, a smiley that is not smiling, not sad. What we will do? Colon key. Then uh, vertical line. Vertical line. So see, this has been drawn. This vertical line is actually uh, above this shift key, above shift key. So next, next uh, professionally, if, uh, when we work professionally in offices, uh, we mostly use copyright sign, registered sign, trademark sign. Now we see how to draw these signs. First, we will draw copyright sign. We will write uh, opening bracket or parent uh, opening bracket or parenthesis. Uh, we will write C. Then we will close this bracket. See, this copyright sign has been drawn. So next, if we want to draw registered sign, 
open bracket or close bracket see this all has been drawn if you can see this is see if you can see this this all has been drawn so now if we want to draw trademark open bracket tm close bracket see this trademark sign has been drawn so next oh, okay let me uh, first clear this all page so next if we want to uh, if we want to draw uh, bullets see what we uh, do actually uh, when we if we don't know shortcut for bullets what we do we go to home then we draw bullets or numbers but now if uh, if we know shortcut to draw bullets we can work speedily what we will do we will write uh, star key that we will press tab c this uh, bullets has been started for example i write here my name adil khalid then i press enter c this has been drawn a b c d e f enter c this bullet has been started but if we want to write numbering what we will do one then close bracket then we will press tab see this has been started what i will do see i write my name then i will press enter see this second number is uh, has come so a b c d e f then enter see this has been start this series has this series has been start if we want to uh, use head a b c d e f alphabetics what we will do a then close bracket then tab key then see this has been started a b a b c d c a b c d e f c this series also has been started now one cool trick if we want to use uh, smileys in place of these bullets what we will do we will draw a smiley we will press tab key see this series also has been started smileys are now we are using smileys as bullets so i will write here something so that i can go to next line so i have written here so i will press enter and go to next line see this uh, next line smiley is automatically appeared here so i will write something here then i will press enter see this smiley is also came here so next thing we uh, do you know we can also use pictures as our bullets okay we try to put here picture and we will use as bullets so uh, actually where i have pictures where i have access to some sample pictures okay we will put this picture here we will make this small first equal to sign of our font or text so we will make this small to make this picture bullets we need to do one thing we need to go here and make it its property in line with text so we will make it smaller sorry this is what is happening i will make it smaller so that this becomes equal to text size i will make it smaller so now i will press tab now i will write something then i will press enter see these bullets also have been started i will press enter see this this picture is now we are using this picture as our bullets so uh, i think now this i think we should finalize this video one uh, very useful thing i think i should mention here uh, mostly people uh, mostly people i also received message from uh, my uh, friends uh, from uh, followers uh, how to capitalize uh, how to make words in a microsoft word capitalize small letters or capital or upper case or lower case uh, i think we should uh, i think we need just 5 seconds to do this uh, maybe i write here my name adil khalid see i will select all this if i will press shift f3 see this has been come upper case then i will press shift f3 this has become become lower case then i will press shift f3 this has been become capitalized first letter is capitalized of each word so we will press again 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 see this is very quick okay friends for now okay friends for now uh, this is enough and we will do some more useful tricks in our next video okay bye bye